Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today is a beautiful day in the farm. And what we're going to be reviewing is the Kuleman pack. There's not just one. There is, what, how many is there? One, two, three, or screw it. We'll, we'll look at it later. But oh my god, guys, have these things like just popped out of nowhere like they've been around forever but i've just recently like looked at them right you have a two million liter like quote unquote auger wagon and then you have just a tiny tiny little little fifty thousand liter thing there it ranges from everything you can imagine guys there's like there's so many different ones so for the sake of this video and not spending way too much money i'm just gonna buy the maximum capacity of each one you can have um wide tires um a ball hitch god you can't even go like the full zoom ball hitch or pin hitch um i'll just go with ball hitch not quite sure and then you can go twin wheels if you go nokian but um trellberg and then wide tires seem to be the one so we're just gonna buy that one um and the mother bin for the 1 million just kind of gets shorter. So, you know what? Screw it. We'll just go through all of them and customize, not even customize, just buy them. So, basically, the shorter they are, the less capacity they have. So, that's all mother bin. So, what a mother bin does is it, like, sits on the side of your field and you empty into the mother bin. So, it's just like a stationary auger wagon and then, like, a truck drives under the auger and then it, it, uh, uh, it empties it and so it's just like a, a storage that kind of like you can just keep emptying from so this is the 150,000 liter um Kuhlman just like uh auger wagon i would say it was because it's not like a it's not too bad these are actually quite big the normal ones that i would normally have are not this big like from what I remember, this was like 77,000 liters, but they must have changed something because, wow. And they have like the literal ones and yeah, just for the sake of it, I'll just, yeah. I mean, you guys get the gist. I'll leave the pack down below, but it's just like, it's crazy the amount of customization. So we're just going to go into here and just get like a JCB just, uh, you know, make sure that we can pull them quickly. So let's tap through here. See, like, like just see how huge these things are. It's insane, man. So we're just gonna like grab a few and like take them out to the field. Oh God, I completely missed that. That's my bad. Um, these are the auger wagons. How you can tell the difference between an auger wagon because this quite literally just looks exactly like the other one so how you can tell is one the top so the top will open up differently i'll show you guys that in a second and two the wheels the wheels on the mother bins are smaller because they're not meant to go through the field you can use them however as an auger wagon if you wanted a two million liter auger wagon but um i doubt anybody wants that not gonna lie i doubt it but um yeah, I'll I'll just go take all these out to the field and I will come back when I get that done. All right, you guys, I've gotten all of the mother bins and auger wagons to the fields. You can see kind of where I've like put them and you know, just this auger wagons, we know we know what what they do. But the cool thing about this pack is actually the mother bins. So obviously we're going to pipe out and cover. It kind of looks like a normal auger wagon, except for the pipe out is kind of slow. I will say that it is uh, quite slow. Um, it looks like a good auger wagon. It's a nice small one. Whereas if you get into the longer one, um, the longer one quite literally is my favorite. Um, so what I'm going to demonstrate here, right, is say you have a full load of grain just kidding wait we need to unfold the mother bin so this is the cool thing here so the mother bin will sit on the side of your field right and you can use it to empty grain into and here we go 
all this stuff will be opening. But see how I have the spigot pointed towards like the road, like the auger pointed towards the road. So ideally, right, I'll kind of give you an example. It won't be a good example because I'll just be using auger wagons for now. But um, so right now, this auger wagon that I'm about to pick up um, will be playing the role of the auger wagon, right? So we're coming in, right? We just we have a full load in the auger wagon and we're like, man, that really needs an empty. But my truck, he's not here. He's still emptying grain. I can't wait. So you empty into this mother bin, right? And then the truck, right? The truck that you would be using, I would be like, oh, okay, Let, let's go like grab the truck or whatever. So like say you're using like course player and multiplayer. These are really helpful for multiplayer. And then you come around, you come to the road and then you get the theoretical grain dumped into you and then you go sell it again. So overall, this pack is really good for multiplayer because if you're harvesting with multiple people and somebody's not back yet to go, you know, empty out anything, auger wagon, harvester, it's a really good pack for that single player. There's not much use for it just because you can do things by yourself unless you're running course player auto drive where things are automated and it's like having a multiplayer server. It's it would work for that, but just normal single player, not really ideal. The mother bins, the auger wagons are great. Uh, I love those for single player, but I definitely would not recommend using the mother bins in single player. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a like and also subscribe down below for more farm sim mod reviews, torque drift car videos, farm sim let's plays, call of duty videos, whatever you guys want, just drop it in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.